Well, still a lot of questions today about how a 13 year old girl was shot at a house in Duquesne. She's now in the hospital fighting to survive. And as Mamie Ball reports, neighbors are praying hard for her recovery. So many unanswered questions about supervision and gun ownership. Allegheny County police who have taken over the investigation tell me we should expect an update sometime soon. Sitting on her front porch, Camlet Roan is wiping away her tears. Just yesterday, she heard a gunshot from the house a few doors down and witnessed a girl she always saw smiling come out in a stretcher bleeding. I'm still thinking about it. I couldn't sleep all night. I couldn't sleep all night. Others on South 7th Street also dealing with insomnia combined with growing disbelief. You see the thought of a 13 year old getting shot and fighting for their life at Children's Hospital is too much to bear. It was trying to do things to forget about it, but you can't forget about it. You know, you just can't. But I hope that everybody's praying for that little girl. Caution tape and flashing blue lights took over the Duquesne Street Tuesday afternoon. Allegheny County police say the shooting happened inside the home. I'm told the girl was there with two of her siblings, her older brother and younger sister. Her father wasn't home. Neighbors tell me he's a single father who does everything he can for his children. Their father is constantly working. He's, teach, he's trying to keep the, the mortgage up and food on the table and clothes for the kids and they're not bad kids. There are so many questions. Who owns the gun? Where did it come from? And most of all, how did this happen? I'm telling you, I just don't. Mm. Duquesne Police Chief Tom Shaw declined our request for an interview, but provided the following comment. It's insane how kids have access to firearms. The situation is sad all around. That can be felt by everyone. You know what, I wish I had a wand, a wand, you know, that I could just touch that little girl. I'm just keep thinking about her. Just thinking about her. I just hope that she'd be all right. I'm told the teenager made it through surgery successfully. That's all the family is willing to share at this time. Reporting from Allegheny County Police Headquarters, Mamie Ba, KDK TV News.